the nature of man. An idealist struggles in this present world and too often learns to be silent before the loud disdain of others. It takes fortitude to be shouted down and to rise again with your diffident words, trembling in the wind of derision. Belittlement is a tool used by the facile of tongue and the narrow of mind. I have seen it in the voices of nations. I have seen it in the marketplace. And I have seen it here in this place of ours, where all poets should be treated with respect. I have seen comments seized as opportunity to disparage thoughtful works and to personalize antagonisms. Such should be beneath us. But the poet, the idealist, the far-seeing one, will continue to struggle to be heard, will send forth words like birds released from cages, for hope is the nature of man.